It all started when I went to the Pittsburgh International Airport to catch my flight to go to Africa. This is a picture I took in the airplane in Cape Town. The Castle of Good Hope was originally located on the coastline of Table Bay. My next stop was Camps Bay. Camps Bay is the most tourist attracted in the summer. Next thing I did was took it took an aerial cable up to the top of Table Mountain. I decided to leave the group and go do something on my own and I went and visited two oceans aquarium. I saw a lot of marine animals. Next, I visited Kugalagagi and saw this cheetah. A fact for the cheetah is it's the fastest animal on earth. Lion is one of the five biggest cats in the panther family. The meerkat or suricate is a small carnivorean belonging to the mongoose family. The giraffe is an African even toed ungulate mammal. Next, I went to the Kalahari Desert and <laughs> took a tour. <laughs> a fact for an elephant is that a lot of people take their tusks and make stuff out of them and that is an endangering elephants. The scientific name for a leopard is Pantheria pardus. Another fact for a lion is that the commonly used term African lion can collectively denotes the several subspecies found in Africa. The caracal is a medium-sized wildcat that is around 3.3 feet long. The cave fox, also called the camo fox or the silver fox, is a small fox. This is a picture of a baby cape fox. 
The yellow mongoose, sometimes referred to as the red meerkat, is a member of the mongoose family averaging about one pound in weight and about 20 inches in length. After the Kalahari Desert, I visited the Lake Victoria. The river connected to Lake Victoria um, goes northern. From there, I did my own thing and I went kayaking and fishing. After that, I went up through the Zimbabwe River through Mali, Tanzania, Burundi, and Rwanda. I entered Uganda to visit to visit the Kabali National Park. In this picture, the, it's a chimpanzee with her chimps. This is a picture of Nairobi. Over 44 million live below the poverty line. My group decided to go into Somalia. After that, we visited this museum. After that, we went to Timbuktu. We saw this priceless architecture. I like this one because of the red and white door. And I like this big one because it's just amazing how people live in it and it's only made out of mud and sand and all. Overall, I had so much fun in Africa and I hope I can visit again.